Hi guys, hope you're all doing well. Today I have a review on a facial cleanser by Lush called Let the Good Times Roll. And from what I, what I understand, this cleanser is only around um, during the fall holiday season. And I purchased this about a week and a half, two weeks ago. So I haven't been using it very long. But I did want to give you my opinion of it. And if it changes, I'll do a follow-up video in at least a month and let you know. Um, but the ingredients are pretty basic. It includes mace flour, glycerin, talc, water, corn oil, corn meal, popcorn, which is really weird, gardenia extract, cinnamon powder, and uh, fragrances. And this product is vegan. And um, compared to other Lush, Lush products, which claim to be natural but have some ingredients I feel iffy with, this one is pretty straightforward. It has the most stunning scent ever. Oh my god, it just smells like delicious caramel, and I've accidentally licked my face while washing it with this, and it, it just tastes like sugar. It's so good. Mm. And it looks like this. It's a sort of jelly texture when you feel it, and it's not as rough as some of the other Lush cleansers. So what I usually do is have a leave my face slightly damp, so not drenching wet, and um, I have slightly damp fingers. I'll take about a quarter size amount of this and I'll rub it between my fingers to get it to thin out and I'll proceed to massage it into my skin. And it is an exfoliator. So this is listed as a facial cleanser and for the first few days I had it, I used it morning and evening just to try it out. My face was definitely brighter and looking good. It wasn't doing much for my breakouts, but my complexion overall was improved while using this, which I still am. However, I opted out of using it every day and I use it maybe every other day as a scrub because I feel that it's a little too rough to use as a cleanser. Uh, I also use um, chemical exfoliators in my skincare routine, so I don't want to overload it by doing so many different things to it. So I only use this every so often. But when I do use it, the smell actually lasts on your skin even after you've rinsed it off and I totally love that. Like I'll go to bed after using this and I could still smell it. And it's such a wonderful scent. If you like like a really sweet, warm caramel scent, you will definitely like this. And if I'm not mistaken, this cost around $15 and I'm going to keep using this in the next several weeks and see how I like it and if I continue to enjoy it as much as I do now I'll probably pick up another one or two and freeze it so I can continue using it as a scrub in my skincare routine but overall I recommend this product you can definitely go to Lush and get a sample of this um, however I wouldn't recommend using this as a cleanser morning and evening. At least use it only once a day and maybe even mix it into your regular cleanser to add a little bit of exfoliation without overdoing it and irritating your skin. Now, one thing I do want to mention is that although this is an, an exfoliating cleanser, it is actually very moisturizing. When I use this for my skin, I do feel that it's cleaner, but it definitely feels moisturized but not oily. It just feels like a good amount of um, hydration and that comes from the glycerin in it which uh, is a humectant and attracts or keeps water in your skin basically so again I recommend checking this out if you've tried this let me know what you think and again if my opinion changes on it I will put up another video otherwise um, it definitely let me know what you think I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you next time